Hey, this is your girl Nyx with the Movie Talk. This week we're going to talk about the movie Batman vs. Superman. Now I have to admit, I love Batman and I love Superman. So why couldn't this be a great movie? Well, it wasn't great. It was just okay. And I say that because it wasn't on the level of Avengers that it should have been on. It should have been on that first Avengers movie where you're sitting there going, yes! But it wasn't. It was real dark. From the beginning to the end, it was really, really dark. Almost like the the early um, Batman movies that Tim Burton did. It was that kind of dark. And, well, it just, the story just didn't really mesh. Like, first off, they had to start off with the backstory of Batman. If you don't know the backstory of Batman and Superman, you don't need to go see this movie at all. Like, who doesn't know that? It's, like, been out since 1930, 1940-something. Everybody knows the backstory, at least a little bit. Come on now. I mean, if you're five, you might not know, but really? Come on now. So, that was a little annoying. And then the guy who played Lex Luthor, he was okay. He wasn't in my mind what Lex Luthor should have been. Like, he wasn't on that level. He should have been, but he did an okay job. Now, Wonder Woman, she was the bomb.com. When she really came on the screen and when she started fighting, it was over like her movie next year is going to be so awesome if they go hard the way they did in this movie with her that's gonna break all records because she's gonna take it and run with it and i'm so excited so overall i'm gonna give batman and superman a c a solid c wasn't great but it wasn't horrible special effects were good but mm, Matinee, you'll love it a lot more. You do need to see it on the big screen to get the full effect, but it was not as awesome as it should have been. Sorry, DC Comics. Marvel is kicking your butt right now. All right, this is Nyx for the Movie Talk.